Laurelton Hall has always been on the cutting edge in providing education to women in the Milford, Fairfield County uh, area. And we've always been looking forward to how can we improve, where is education moving to, and how can we get there. We've moved away from teacher stands at the front of the room, in front of the whiteboard, while students sit in desks facing her. To me, if I picture a task-based classroom, I picture like a startup company common room. You know, like tables over here, whiteboards near each one, laptops available yeah. anywhere you want to go with them, a common area that's open enough for large-scale experiments to be taking place or demonstrations or presentations. Um, room enough that I can be mobile. We teach them how to be learners, not just how to find information or research. We teach them to do all of the pieces of that and to um, have within themselves a true appreciation of what they're doing and what they're learning and how they're going forward in life. I believe um, Laurelton has prepared me for the future um, by giving me the necessary tools I need to succeed. So I am going to college next year and I feel that by the curriculum I'm taking now and the challenging teachers, um, I feel like I'm prepared for many college professors and the academics. That if they look at the accomplishments of the Laurelton graduates over the years, not just now, but the the roles that the women who have graduated from Laurelton have played, the proof is there for what is going on at Laurelton and the accomplishments that we have. And as Laurelton becomes better known and even more prominent and more women from Laurelton assume leadership roles in industry and in academia and the scientific fields, being a Laurelton girl is going to be a better and better thing, not just for the individual, but to have that in your background as you go through your life will become more and more important.